dear viewers welcome back in this video we are going to study the notes of karnataka state syllabus class 6 social science history chapter 3 kodagu kittur tulunadu and hyderabad karnataka uh, this is the notes of uh, text book part 2 if you want the notes of uh, part 1 textbook all the notes are available in my playlist uh, you can check from there so question number 1 name the place of origin of the river kaveri answer tala kaveri Question number two, name the important dynasties that ruled Kodagu. Answer, Haleri dynasty. Question number three, why did the Amarasulai rebellion break out? Answer, the British imposed a heavy land revenue in Kodagu. The peasants of Amarasulai could not bear the heavy burden and so they rose in an armed revolt against the British. Next, Kittur. Question number one, why did Rani Chennama of Kittur fight against the British? Answer, Rani Chennama of Kittur was the younger wife of Malasarja, the Desai of Kittur. Both Malasarja and his son died. Rani Chennama adopted Shivalinga Sarja and started administrating Kittur. The collector of Dharwar, Thakeri, objected to the adopting as improper. He recommended the British government to take over the administration of Kittur. On hearing this, Chennama became extremely angry. She opposed the British policy of suppressing Kittur and decided to light for the freedom of her land. Question number two. Who is Sangoli Rayana? How did he met his end? Answer. Yeah. Sangoli Rayana was a loyal follower of Rani Chennamma. A brave freedom fighter, he emerged from the rank of common people. After Chennamma's imprisonment, he assumed the leadership of Kittur resistance and organized an army. He attacked British officers and looted their treasuries. Adopt in guerrilla warfare, Rayana was like a frightening dream to the British. As the British could not defeat him, they resorted to foul means they bribed a few person who turned traitors. They captured Rayanna by deceit and handed him to the British. Soon Rayanna and his associates were hanged. Tulunadu. Question number one. Name the royal family which ruled for the longest period in Tulunadu. Alupa dynasty. Question number two. Who was Ullala Abbakarani? Answer, Ullala Abbakarani was from the Chauta family of Tulunadu royals. She fought against the Portuguese and defeated them. Question number three, who was Ferdinand Kittel? Answer, Ferdinand Kittel compiled the first Kannada dictionary who was, which was printed at the Basel Mission Press, Mangaluru. Question number four, where is the thousand pillared Basati located? Answer, Moda Bidre. Question number three, which are the ancient popular arts of Tulunadu? Answer, Telamadalli. Question number six, why is Karnad Sadashiva Rao remembered? Answer, Kambala, Cockfight, Chinne, Yakshagyana. Question number seven, what was the social work undertaken by Kudmul Ranga Rao for the upliftment of the Harijans? Answer, Deshabhakta Karnad Sadashiva Rao re rendered unforgettable service to the Karnad Sadashiva Rao rendered unforgettable service to the cause of Harijans. He offered meals to the Harijans children in his home. He sacrificed everything for the freedom of his motherland. Question number eight. Name the major banks of India established in Tulinadu. Answer. Kudmul Ranga Rao led a social reform movement for the upliftment of the Harijans. He actively worked for the education of the Harijans. He actively worked and removal of untouchability. While in Mangaluru, Gandhiji saw the social activists of Kudmul Ranga Rao and appreciated them. Then Hyderabad and Karnataka. Question number one. What were the causes for the revolt of the be the Nayakas. Answer. Answer. Canara Corporation uh, syndicate Karnataka and Vasa banks. Exploitation by the local zamindars. Operation by the British. The Arms Act and the Forest Act 1857. Question number two. What was the act that the Be the Nayakas of Halagalli opposed? Answer. Arms Act of 1857. Question number three, who was Rami? Answer, Rami was a valiant Bidanayaka woman who actively participated in the revolt. She shot dead three British soldiers and became a martyr. Question number four, who was Sindhu Lakshma? 
Lakshmana. Answer Sindhura Lakshmana was a remarkable leader who fought against the British. Sindhura village was under the firm hold of the local Imandar Gauda. Uh, Lakshmana openly challenged him. Soon he became the enemy of the British. Question number 5. What was the role played by Surapura Venkatappa Nayaka in the first war of independence 1857-58? Answer Though Venkatappa Nayaka received English education, the love of independence and patriotism were deep rooted in him. Meanwhile, strong waves of the first war of independence also began to reach Surapura. Venkatappa Nayaka immediately decided to join the war. The young ruler received support from Mundargi Bhimaraya, Baba Saheb of Naragund and others. The British army laid siege to the fort of Surapura. A terrible fight ensued on the second lay a senior officer of the british army died in the battlefield this was a setback to the british hence the british decided to take with fraud by fraud an important officer of the nayaka revealed to the british the secret approach to the surapura fort thereby helped them to gain victory Venkatappa managed to escape to Hyderabad. His aim was to recruit more soldiers with the help of Nizam. But Salar Jung, the Nizam Prime Minister, expecting some reward from the British, made Venkatappa Nayaka a captive and handed him over to the British. The British awarded to death sentence to Venkatappa Nayaka. Later, the punishment was reduced to four years of imprisonment. When under captivity, Venkatappa Nayaka was shot dead by the British. Not only this, the British spread the rumour that it was a suicide on the part of Venkatappa Nayaka. He was 24 at that time. Thus, the life of an extraordinary freedom fighter who sacrificed everything for his motherland ended. Question number 6. Who was Kalagapti? Kala Answer. The Nizam brought into force 53 rules called the Kalagapti which took away the fundamental freedom of the people. Question number 7. Who was Swami Ramananda Tirtha? Answer. Swami Ramananda Tirtha is one of, was one of the popular leader of the Hyderabad Karnataka freedom struggle. Question number 8. Who is called Karnataka Gandhi? Answer. Hardikar Manjappa. Question number 9. Who was the brave leader of Vande Matar movement? Answer. Ramachandra Rao. Question number 10. Who, what was the role played by Shranagauda Inamdar in the Hyderabad liberation struggle? Answer. Sharan Gowda Inamdar was the young leader who organized the underground activities by enrolling the youths. They made lightning attacks on the Razakhs. As a result, many villagers were freed from the atriochoids of the Razakhs. The people called Sh Sharana Gowda Sardar out of great respect. So this is all about your classic social science notes of Kodaga, Kittur, Tulunadu and Hyderabad, Karnataka Adish, uh, question and answers. Uh, if you want the more lessons, you can subscribe to my channel. As I have told you, if you want the previous lessons, you can check the playlist of my channel. Thanks for watching.